Hello everybody, I'm Lightning Flash, and today we've got us some boot polish, we've got us a rag, and we got us some boots. So now we are going to, well, we're going to polish the boots. So what you want to do is you want to pop this thing up right here, which removes the lid like that. It's kind of like the shape of a snuff container. You want to take some of this boot polish right here, get it on the rag like this. Now you want to just take your boot, start wiping it in. Don't know how dark this is going to make the boot, but it's supposed to be brown boot polish. So just want to keep wiping it in. Get it all in there nice and good, like so. Do a little more. It's probably best you watch other videos on this and don't just follow what I do because I make these um, how-to videos and I have no idea what I'm doing and I'm just um, rolling with it. So it works for me usually, but I wouldn't use this as the Bible for doing stuff. But I mean, you're just following me on my journey through this. So just take it, rub it down. This is making it quite dark on this lower end, so I'm not going to do it on this because this is extremely dark already. Just get the toes all polished up. Kind of like the darkness that it's doing. Probably best that you get, make sure to get the right shade of brown for your boots. This says, shoe polish, protects leather, brown. So, didn't say what shade of brown. So apparently it's right. It's gonna be nasty. Get off my hands. It smells good. Not sure exactly how much, so we're just gonna guess. I guess put as much on there as you would like. I mean, I guess the more the merrier. The more you have on there, probably better protection it gives you. Not sure if this stuff dries on or not, but. People have been using boot polish for hundreds of years, so. Make sure to subscribe, because if you don't subscribe, I made a bet with my brother, where if I don't reach 100, 515 subscribers by the 15th, he gets to shoot me in the back with an airsoft gun. And if I win, I get to shoot him in the back. So, subscribe, guys, if you want to see that. Probably have to try to get him to agree to that off camera, but... We'll, we'll do something. And then 10,000 subscribers. I'll make a video on this later. I'm going to lay on green chestnut burrs. I don't know if I'm going to wear a shirt or not. I want to wear a shirt when I do it because I know it's really going to hurt. Because when you get pricked by a chestnut burr, it continues to hurt a long time after it happens. A little bit more on this boot and then we'll go to the next one. Not sure what this smells like, but all I know is it's looking pretty good. You can see it properly. Probably should have taken a before and after shot. If you just rewind the video to the beginning, you could probably see a good enough angle. Well, I would say that thing's done pretty much. It's a little bit of um pieces of it on here I'll have to get off. But for my specific specifications, this seems like a pretty nice boot. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. And I know. You're probably feeling like you have no life watching a guy wipe polish on a boot, but I mean, if you're like me, you're single, what do you got better to do? Some of us don't have jobs yet. We're just living life to the fullest. Well, not the fullest. Living life the best we can. Someday we won't be losers, okay? Just, I don't know, this is kind of satisfying. I could do this for a living. Polishing the boot. There's a scar right here. 
when you're bigger than your brother, heavier, don't get on his back and try to get a piggyback ride. Not a good idea, and that's why there's a scar on my boot. If I could do it over, I probably wouldn't have done that. Fun while it lasted, but then when you fall, it's kind of, you kind of don't feel good afterwards. So, get this all nice and in here. This is supposed to protect it too, so not just make it look nice, it's supposed to protect it. These leaves are quite annoying. Get this stuff in here. Just get a little bit more polish, like so. Take it in here. Get it all deep in the, deep in the grooves. I just got it on my elbow. Not probably the best idea. You just gotta work it in there. I mean, it's made it a little darker, but that's pretty much it. it hasn't really affected the color. I mean, I kind of like it. I have to wait for it to dry the best, and then probably see the better results of it. At this point, probably no one's watching because, well, I'm polishing the boot with a rag. Not really that special, but sometimes there's some people that would like to see that. My average view duration is like four minutes into a 10-minute video, and then everyone leaves. If you stay that long, make sure to leave a like. Um, four minutes just watching that helps a lot, but... I'll be done here in a minute, and then I'll do my closing thing where, you know, what I say... And we'll be out of here. But to all you that kept watching, thank you. Hopefully bright days are ahead. Hopefully people like me won't be losers for much longer. I mean, pretty good accomplishments. We're almost about to reach 500 subscribers. We're about to get the community tab. Can't wait for that. I think there's a chipmunk over there. Okay, y'all. Boots are done. Don't know how good you can see them. It's getting pretty dark, but they're looking pretty good. And if I have to do more, make sure to do it. I guess you could just, what you want to do is just go back over it once it, I guess, dries. And if you don't think you got enough, add some more. Okay, that's it for this video, you guys. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to keep up to date. And as always, keep it electrified. I'll see y'all later.